for the people that truly need it and that are not illegal or uh, trying to get amnesty in our country. We need to use that money wisely. And I, one of the things I want to say, too, is I was hoping we'd cut back taxes as every single thing possible in America. We don't need all these taxes. There's way too many taxes. If we have to have a flat tax, OK. But we need to cut all taxes out so that we're not so overburdened. But again, I do want to support the elderly and the poverty-stricken, true citizens any way I can. Tom? I'm so grateful that Dr. Gosser acknowledges that I'm the economic expert here that can solve the economy. Thanks, Paul. <laughs> Appreciate that. Capital gains and the estate gift tax are directly tied. All three of those stop liquidity, which is the principal function of capitalism. Free and liquid markets is what we need. Ranchers and farmers and small business owners, when one or both of the owners die, it crushes the longevity and the perpetuity of that business. So we get 55% or more of that entity, which has paid millions in taxes over their lifetime, to this vast black hole in Washington. So it makes sense to me. Milton used to thump you on the head when he came up on something dumb like that. What I do with the massive revenue that we would generate? Pay off the debt. Have to reduce the debt. It's the number one killer right now. 13 trillion in rising. Discretionary spending, slash it to the bone. We don't need it. It's not in the Constitution, we don't pay for it. All gets back to, Joe made a good point about the insurance, insurance premiums, these fancy things they do to sell life insurance policies to pay for the estate tax. Insurance companies will come up with another product, trust me, no problem there. Pay down the debt, eliminate this discretionary spending, and get rid of these owner's taxes that crush small business owners. Can you imagine a rancher who's got a place up here in Fresco, or right here, a small business, True Value Hardware, Ace Hardware? Where are they going to come up with a couple million dollars in taxes nine months after mom and dad die? Let them keep it. They know what to do with the money. Washington will just squander it in something stupid. Thank you. Thank you. I'm um, staying with the tax line of questioning. Um, to the extent you haven't already answered this, if you could do over our federal tax system, what would it look like? And let's go to Joe. Redo the federal tax system. Yes. Again. Um, Home team, I'm from Conway, Arizona. We're supposed to give me the softball, but you want me to redo the whole tax code? Defer to me, Joe. I know the answer. The president just added 16,000 IRS agents to put to, to reform health care. Um, I think the, the two popular um, schools out there are either a, a flat tax or, or a um, the fair tax. And I would be more in, I, I think what's more doable is actually the, uh, the fair tax because it does keep some semblance of the IRS uh, in intact versus uh, going the other direction. I think we go to like consumption tax, which would um, make a more aggressive move on the IRS. So I, th I think that the the, uh, the latter would be the safest. Thank you, um, John. Uh, yeah, I think we just need to revisit, rewrite, kind of restructure uh, into either a fair or flat, just, and so that basically we're not paying so much. I think, you know, like I said, we're, we're trying to, if we have to pay Caesar, I can pay it, but I, I go all the way down to the city, the local, the state, and the federal. Uh, too much is dependent on too much things, and I feel like there's a lot of waste. Even in the state, there's some schools, they built some schools that aren't even being used projecting we were going to have a lot more growth before the recession hit. It's just, uh, and we have to pay it. And then the, uh, the federal government keeps saying they're going to build, get more jobs, and it's just crazy. So they're getting new bills passed, and it's just, we're just, we're paying for something that's never going to end. They're, they keep making excuses that we got to do this, we got to have a stimulus. Stimulus to me is another big waste. We need to stop all this spending, balance the deficit, Stop the spending, stop, and it, that goes all the way down to the city governments, all the way up to the federal, and I just think we need to get taxes back in perspective, like the Founding Fathers said, just barely to pay the bills, not to pay for 